Gun violence has plagued the city of Durham since the start of the new year. Now the city is looking into shot spotter technology. It's a story we first told you about on Friday. CBS 17's Derek Lewis digging deeper into that technology to show you how it works and if it really makes an impact. Councilman Mark Anthony Middleton tells me the sound of gunshots makes families in Durham hide for their safety. Young people should not be having that conversation about getting in their bathtubs, gunfire breaks out. And if they are having it, for me as a, as a government official, as an elected official, that's a cue that we need to be putting all of our brain power, all of our intellect, all of our creativity into addressing this issue. Police are considering Shot Spotter. It's a series of microphones designed to detect the sound of a gunshot and pinpoint its location within 25 meters. Police are then alerted of the location almost instantly. Middleton just wants something done to reduce gun violence. Well, I'm not pushing this as the solution or even a solution. What I am pushing, however, is a conversation. Conversations are happening. I've learned ShotSpotter has helped reduce gun violence by 40% in one Chicago neighborhood. It enables the police to detect or to affect a fast and precise response to over 90% of gunfire incidents within the coverage area. And that has a strong deterrent impact and disrupts the gun violence. Phil Daly works for ShotSpotter. While the results are there, people still have concerns, like whether the device could pick up or nearby innocent conversations. When it comes to the shot spotter system, it's really important to understand that human voices do not trigger the sensors. Our system's designed to only trigger an alert when we detect a very loud, impulsive sound, one loud enough that it needs to trigger at least three sensors, some of which could be hundreds of yards away. This is why Middleton is pushing for more discussion. He's hoping it will lead to something that helps Durham reduce gun violence. Durham is not sequestered from the rest of the country. We have a, a gun culture in America. Uh, so it's not just about what's going on now. It's about ha having things in place uh, because of our growth. Middleton tells me he plans to talk about this tonight at Durham's city council meeting. I will be at that meeting and have any updates on this topic. In Durham, I'm Derek Lewis, CBS 17 News.